Hey guys, how's it going? So I have my camera set up there because I just wanted to give a quick review of my Galaxy Z Fold 4. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I got this uh, phone. It's a Samsung Galaxy phone uh, because I wanted to... Uh, I needed a, an additional GPS for the truck. So instead of buying a, you know, a, a truck GPS for like five, six hundred dollars, you know, even up to nine hundred, that's how much they are right now. I just ended up uh, getting the new Z Fold, you know, and I got a really good deal. I got the I got the Pro Watch 2 and the phone and the case and the the pen, everything for like eight hundred dollars. So because I traded in my phone, so it was a good deal. And you know, I had it for like a month and a half, two months now. So I, I definitely uh, can can tell you guys like why I think it's like a really good phone, and uh, you know it's definitely worth it, especially if you're going to be using it as a secondary or like a third GPS, you know, for the truck. Uh, I think the phone does a really good job, you know. So you have the standard. That's how it looks like, you know, when you just like uh, have it, you know. So you. Uh, so you, this is the screen. It has like three screens basically. This is what this is what happens when you open it up and stuff like that. When you turn it on, then if you wanna, you know, you can use it like this most of the time, and it works as a normal phone and whatever. But you know, I have a stand here. I'm gonna show you guys quickly in a moment. Uh, so when I use it for as a GPS, you know, I just open it up, you know. And then I have here my, I'm going to use my fingerprint to open it up, which is kind of cool, I think. And uh, here, so, you know, I, you can see the screen is like very big. It's so, like a tablet, like a mini tablet, you know. It's really good for watching movies. You know, I have my Netflix, I have HBO, Amazon Prime and everything. So, you know, I watch a lot of stuff when I'm, when I'm, uh, you know, when I'm not driving and stuff like that. And I'm having lunch and whatever. So yeah, I have all my main apps here. I don't need to go left or right, you know. I have all my apps in one screen, which is really good, you know. Uh, so this is the main thing I wanted to show you guys, you know, the 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 ability to use the you know multiple apps at once. I think that's really good, especially for the truck driving, you know. So I have this uh, uh, app called Hammer. This is the main. This is one of the main ones I use for truck driving. Uh, besides my you know my GPS and whatever that comes with the truck so when I open it up you know I have a route set up and stuff like that I have a route right now it's about eight hours you know 500 miles to uh, I'm going to um, where am I going to Springfield so this is what I really think is kinda cool about it because I have my main GPS on the on the dashboard over there so I can use that as my main uh, guidance, you know. But then, you know, I can also, you know, what that GPS doesn't show you, which I think it's kind of cool about this one, is that shows you all the truck stops along the way, you know. So I basically map the same route that I'm going to be using on the main truck one. And I just basically, you know, I have it open here. And I can use it like you know when I'm when I'm driving and stuff when I'm when I'm going, for example, you know if I if I wanna stop to get like coffee or, you know, use the bathroom or anything you know or wanna grab some food, I can see my choices here you know, as I'm driving, you know all the truck stops and stuff like that, and I don't have to be touching a lot you know I just have it open like this you know, and I just follow I I can just kind of see like oh. You know, when I see a pilot, you know, and stuff like that, uh, loves and whatever, you know. So that's really cool. But here's the another really cool thing that I think about that, that I think it's really cool, you know. Sometimes, you know, people have people like to use Google Maps or the other one, uh, Trucker Path, which I, Trucker Path is really good, I think, too. So, you know, you can have multiple apps open. So, for example, let's say I want to bring Google Maps here. I can either put it below here, you know, which is like this. And I can see like, you know, the restaurants around me and whatever, you know. So you can see you can have like two type of maps at once going on, you know. So you can like, you know, you can be driving because Google Maps can tell you like, oh, we're Lobs right now. But there's also like a restaurant here, like a hotel and whatever. 
So that's kind of, I think that's really like a really cool feature of the phone, you know? And you can also swap it too. For example, if you want to like to have the screens here, hold on, let me, you can put it like r right here, you know? So it's like uh, vertical instead of horizontal. So that's kind of cool, you know? Whichever preference you have and stuff like that. So you can have uh, multiple uh, maps going on at once, which is even better. Uh, and I don't think you can do that with the GPS, you know, uh, with the standard GPS and stuff like that. And I think that's like a really cool thing about it. So you have this, right? And then uh, what I wanted to show you guys too was like, uh, you know, you can have uh, the multiple screens. The camera is incredible. The camera, I think the camera is really, really good. It has the S22 Plus camera. So, you know, the quality of the camera is extremely well and uh, you know it's a very good design and I like the ability to switch screens and stuff like that so let's say you, you want to go back to the main menu you know you can just uh, it kind of works as windows you know the tab below here it's like the main tab you know you got your calendar you know I have a I have additional stuff I have some crypto here I have my calculator uh, you know and so yeah that's I don't I don't need to like I've seen some people's phones and they just got apps and it's like a mess you know I like to organize my stuff you know which is really good with this phone so because the screen is really big and stuff like that and I mainly use it I had the C Flip 3 too the one that flips the smaller one but you know that one was like a really good phone too but because uh, I needed to get like a secondary GPS I just decided to get this instead you know so um, it comes with the the pen too. I, I haven't really used the pen uh, that much, but as you can see, it's very very uh, accurate and just like really good. You know, it feels really nice, and you can just like swap it and put it like in the back here. Right now, I have the stand, uh, which I'm gonna show you here. So you can just take it out, take this out really quick, and you can just put the pen here. You know. I highly recommend that you guys get a case too so it sits like that you know and very good very sleek design you know very strong I dropped it a few times already uh, and I know these phones are really good you know the plastic too you know I think the plastic uh, lasts like a long time obviously over time it will wear out that happened to my C Flip 3 but you know the newer the phones get the, the better the quality and stuff like that <laughs> we can hope so yeah i highly recommend if you're looking for like a gps type of phone you know uh, i think this is a good addition and now what i'm gonna show you guys is my stand here which i used to uh, set up the map here so give me one second here i'm gonna flip the camera here and just bring the phone here and this is my dashboard here so i have this little stand here i'm gonna put a link to it and it fits perfectly for the phone too. So I'm just gonna open the phone. Give me one second here. And hold on guys. And then yeah, you can have the map here. So I have my map and then I have my secondary map here. My secondary navigation system here. So you can see it's like basically the same size, you know. And this the stand is really good. Like, you know, it hasn't fallen off. And it's like really easy to remove, you know. I'm gonna put a link below. If you guys are looking for the right stand for the for this type of phone, you know. So yeah, uh, yeah, that's what I wanted to show you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you. Bye bye.